I recently put out a video in regards to Pluto talking about how these new images they just put out were showing along the horizon there are these massive dark spots like craters circular in nature but they're only around that specific part of the equator now they said here by the 14th 15th of this month they should have very good information regarding all this mystery surrounding these spots now 10 days before it's due to make this closest approach the agency is stating that on July 4th yesterday afternoon right around 2 p.m. Eastern they lost contact with this 700 million dollar unmanned flyby mission they said they lost contact for more than an hour and 20 minutes they were able to regain a signal from the probe via NASA's deep space network at 315 p.m. but as a result the spacecraft systems have entered into a safe mode until they can diagnose this problem so at this point it's on autopilot and it's programmed in this situation to switch to its backup computer and then try to directly set up communications with earth now they're also stating that here in the meantime they're gonna to try to get it back to its original flight path which is going to take some time and while they're doing this it may take up to several days they will not be able to collect any scientific data is what they're saying so they get this close they say this is what happens when you're three billion miles from home but you know out of all of the images we've seen they've landed on uh, the Rosetta mission landing on that body in space while it's moving and never seen any kind of breakup like this they get these mystery images these mystery craters popping up in these shots they tell us about it and the next thing you know they've lost control that's how I'm saying it so if they do end up giving us any images from here on out they will be extremely closer and I'm not so sure if they're going to do that. I'll leave a link. Eyes to the skies.